Good morning. I uh, we recently had some straight line winds. Night before last, three nights ago. Got my insurance adjuster out here yesterday, but got a couple of holes in the house, which really kind of angered me a little bit because we just re-roofed the house uh, a couple of years ago, and so you know why couldn't it happen then? and have insurance help out with that ordeal, but uh, the joys of home ownership, I guess. Anyway, check this out. My neighbor and I uh, are a little closer now because of this uh, these straight line winds. You can see it uh, blew the top out of that tree went straight through the fence. So, that's exciting. There's a lot of tree here too. There's a second piece there. The piece closest to us is probably, I don't know, 14 inches thick. Something like that. So that's going to be a process. And uh, let me back up and see if we can get the tree. I, uh, like I said, the insurance guy came out. And after Katrina, you know, we live here in Mississippi. There was a lot of wind damage in Mississippi during Katrina. And after that happened, a lot of the insurance companies pulled out of the market uh, here. And then the ones that stayed, they created a uh, two deductibles standard deductible for fire and theft and that sort of thing and then a wind damage deductible which is different and much higher which I was unaware of until the guy came out here yesterday and he showed me my policy and turns out uh, with the two holes in my roof and the, the fence being demolished uh, my deductible is still so high on wind damage that uh, he, he didn't figure you know it's going to cover the deductibles or the deductible you know, is going to cover it all, so they're not going to pay out anything. Anyway, let me move back and see if you can see the top of this tree. See that? Just pop the top right off that tree, which will probably not live, but I'm sure it won't live, actually. I mean, look at that. There's no the left for it. But anyway, Thought I'd show that off because I'm a little bit unhappy with that. This is uh, Samuel Gawa squadron leader, uh, Peterson. I uh, I cut the stem. I haven't polished it yet. I don't know if you can see it or not on this camera. Let's see if I can... I don't know if there's a macro mode or not. No, maybe not. You can't really see that, but... That's another video. Anyway, uh... I'm mad about my fence. God bless you and I hope you have a wonderful day.